Hello everybody, how y'all doing today? Hope everybody having a wonderful day. I want to explain to people uh, about my Please Me song and my uh, Party with C-Message song. My situation is not like a regular situation. I want you to understand this, so I'm going to try to explain to you briefly. I wrote Please Me out of Fantasy Lover, out of a true story from an ex-lover ex-boyfriend and I gave please I gave uh, fantasy lover to Jay White the handwritten lyrics uh, he said he couldn't do it brought it back to him again with a drum beat he said he couldn't do it so I wrote please me so please me came out of fantasy lover a certain verse because the verses I had so many verses I said let me write another song out of it so I wrote it out of that and then I wrote another song out of another verse well, anyway in other words they took from two songs I wrote a song and I wrote a song out of it and they took out of that Okay, then you have her Barley Carly song. When you get to party, uh, Carly part, it sounded more like mine. The music sounded more like mine. But she throws you off with the guy coming in slow, saying party with him. Don't go by that. Pick up her part, and you'll see. She's saying party with Carly, party with Carly. Now she's saying bees want to party with Carly. They, they put up a video, they take one down and put another one up. This is what I've seen with my own eyes. Same thing with Please Me. She had another video up, didn't have no J's or nothing like that in it, or whatever, the, whatever she's talking about. Anyway, she has another video of Please Me. And you got to remember, this is not a regular situation. My music guy, I know him. I knew him very well. I thought I did anyway. Well, anyway, he stayed with me for free. He had no place to go. And the young lady that's on that tape saying that she verified he stayed with me and that he, she believed he rewrote my song, he had a crush on her. She stayed with me at the same time. This is not a person that's bitter about anything. I'm just upset because I spent money on my resources. You didn't spend the money on my resources. I spent a lot of money. Jay White made a lot of money off me. And I want to say this. Imagine if your music guy stayed with you, you knew him pretty well, and his wife, and you let him, they separated. I guess they separated. I don't know. He came stay with you. He asked you. You let him come stay because he's doing music. He had already did about six beats. Every time I gave Jay White my lyrics before he even made the music, he didn't write any lyrics to please me. He didn't write any lyrics to Let's Party with C-Message. And I'm very upset because he teased me over those songs. Those, those were the only two songs he mentioned something about. On the, on the uh, Party with C-Message song, he said, you can't write a song like that about yourself. You're not a star. He turned around and wrote that for Carly B. Got her in there saying Party with Carly. Think about it. Two songs. It's not just one song. So in other words, they took from really three songs. And think about it. I've already went over this with you guys. I'm not going to let them get away with it. And they want me to stop talking about it. And I'm telling you, if I'm lying, she got the money to sue me. She's suing a blogger over a hearsay mess about she got some type of this, something. I don't know. Well, anyway, you can look at the tape. It's been up for about two or three years. Okay? If she can sue that blogger, she can sue me if I'm lying. And I already told you, I don't have the money to sue them. It's a lot of money. And I know they took out some of my lyrics. I'm not going to say who. I don't know who. But I'm not going to allege this. I'm not going to allege this. You don't have to believe my story. You can believe the famous and rich all you want to. And I'm not talking about all of them. But I know my music guy rewrote my songs. We got the same music guy. Same music guy for both songs. And it took, out, took from three songs. And... The statute of limitation has not ran out. And I'm going to get them people that hacked me. I got five years on that. And I got, a, I got time. I got time. I'm going to keep talking about it. Because this didn't happen to you. This happened to me. This happened to me. I spent money. And he knew I was selling them songs. And I've already showed you I've been hacked. Go look. Have a nice day, everybody. Bye.